I'm Terry Johnson, one of the co-creators of the Corkles, and today we are going to do an activity that goes along with our Andy Acid book. We have a young scientist with us today. What's your name? Michaela. And what grade are you in, Michaela? Third grade. Third grade, and it's almost the end of school, isn't it, Michaela? <laughs> yeah. Yes, that's great. Well, Michaela, do you like science? Yes. And do you like the quirkles? Yes. Yes, and you've heard of Andy Acid? Yeah. Great. Well, I'm excited to do this activity with you today. Now, all we have to do in our first one is just make our liquid turn red. Now, that is going to be easy. So I'm going to give you that and I'm going to take this and all we have to do is we're going to put our cabbage juice indicator. This is made from cabbage leaves that we boiled and water and that gives us an acid base indicator. So it smells but it works. <laughs> we can smell it can't we Michaela? Yeah. So we're going to take our dropper can you take your dropper there? And we're going to put just a couple of drops in our liquid. So let's just squeeze some. And Michaela's good at science, so she'll be able to, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna get it to turn a pinkish red. And I'm gonna keep uh, doing, uh, oh man. Well, hmm. well that. Kayla, can you? Well, mine didn't turn red. Huh, I wonder what that means. I don't know, do you? No. No, well, you know, I think I've heard something about the pH scale. And I drew just a little diagram to kind of help us make it a little easier because it's a little hard concept to understand. Liquids are either acidic or basic. And if it has a pH level of seven, we call that neutral. Water is considered neutral. Vinegar is considered very acidic. Anything seven and below or below seven is considered acidic and turns kind of a reddish pink color in the presence of cabbage juice. Water would stay neutral and then anything above seven is considered a base and would turn more of a bluish green color. So based on that information, yours turned red and mine did not change any color. What do you think that means? It's an acid, you're right. In fact, yours is vinegar which is about a 2-2 on the pH scale, and mine didn't change, so that means it must be a neutral, so mine was water, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, well, let's see what happens this time. Now you're going to get this liquid, and I'm going to take this liquid, and let's see what happens and see if we can figure out where it is on the acid base indicator. Let's take our cabbage juice or what the kids call stinky juice. <laughs> Let's put it in there and see what happens. Mm. Ah, what color is yours turning, Michaela? Green. Green and mine is turning pink. Kind of a pinkish red, isn't it? So Michaela, what do you think that means? What kind of liquid do you think you have? Would you have an acid or a base? A base. A base. Your cup had ammonia, which is about 11 on the pH scale, and I had lemon juice, which is about a 2220 on the pH scale. So very good. So that's how we tell if something is acidic or basic. The pH means the power of hydrogen. Okay, well thank you for joining me, Michaela. And for more information, check out our Quirkles YouTube or www.quirkles.com. Thank you for joining me, Michaela. Say bye-bye. Bye. 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 bye.